today is the big day. We're going to find out if this former U2 tennis player can become a pickleball pro instructor. And this is my pickleball channel where you can find all pickleball related things. What's going on? My name is Brandon. Today we're about to find out if I can become a certified pickleball instructor. I'm a former D3 tennis player and I just started picking up pickleball since February. Today is June 16th, so it's been about four months. Prior leading up to today, you have to sign up online at the PPR. You pay a one year registration fee, then you sign up for the workshop. The workshop varies, they travel from different states. I was lucky to find one about an hour away in Virginia at the Pickleballers in Chantilly. When you sign up, you should receive an email explaining all the back end information that you will need and where your workshop details will be held. Headshot, years of pickleball playing experience, years of pickleball teaching, UTPR official rating, and then where you can find your USA pickleball member number. It will explain how to get to your modules to do your pre-course on your teachable platform before coming to your workshop. You must score at least a 90% or better on each quiz to progress to the next lesson. If you do not score at least 90 on the lesson quiz, you'll have to reset the quiz and try again. Besides that, you have to pay one more $35 fee and then you are all set to go. The workshop is in person. It's 11.30 to 4.30. They said bring water, bring your paddles, bring your equipment, and they're gonna run down everything you need to know about being a teacher. Let's go. right outside of the pickleballers to get certified to be a professional pickleball instructor you had to sign up online register for the course do the pre-course you have to pay the fees and then the workshop which includes live play going over material and then doing some deals and drinks and then to be honest i'll do a recap because i don't even know i haven't done it yet but here we go all right just got done with the workshop 11.30 to 4.30 and here's my little recap of what went down. It was held at the Pickleballers in Chantilly, Virginia. We got there, our pro instructor name was Sonny. Very informative, very great teacher. Covered all the bases and just didn't leave any stone unturned. So when we got there, what to expect? First, we did a little bit of name introduction. If you get there a little bit earlier, you can use the court time and just hit with the other coaches that are there, which is pretty fun. Greet and meet, do a little networking. Once 11.30 came, we started the session and he explained his name, what we'll be doing, what we'll be covering. Then he kind of jumped into us hitting and he was observing, watching us, kind of evaluating and assessing where we're at. Then he brought us in, talked about what he was going to do, and then we started with the lessons. So we started at the non molly zone. He explained how a lesson goes, introduce your name, get their names, cover the topic, and then do some warm ups. Then you get into the lesson, non volley zone. You want to let them play a little bit, observe. Then you want to bring them in. You want to analyze. You want to make sure that you're giving some comments on their positioning, maybe hitting the ball in the front. Then you go into some games. Then after a couple of games, you let them do a little bit of live play. And then when you stop and finish class, you want to bring them back in. You want to go over what they did well and then what the lesson will be for next week and always remember to cool down and stretch. And he basically did that for the transition zone as well as serve and returns. And that basically took up the whole workshop. We were all rotating one another. Sometimes we had a group of three, sometimes we had a group of four, where one of us was the instructor, kind of leading the class, doing the whole routine. And then by the end of it, we we're asking feedback from the other instructors on each of the segments from in the volley zone, the transition zone, and the serve and return. After that, and we all felt comfortable, it came around three o'clock, he asked for already the test, which then we will have an official time, it has to be, I believe, under 15 minutes. You have to do one intro class, either you pick a serve, return, transition zone, or volley, and you have to fully teach it, names, your name, their names, topic, and then a warm up. Those are the four main points you have to hit. Then you let them do a little live play. You wanna see if you're doing serve, just let them hit a couple serves back and forth walk the court, make sure you make a little couple comments, but not teaching right there. 
After that, you bring them all close in. You give them some technical teachings about what you want to look forward to, what they did good, what they did bad. Then you want to engage them in a little bit of drills or games. Mostly drills, I think, first. Then you do another, bring them in, do an assessment, and then you give them games or you do a little live play with them. Then you end wrapping up what we did, what we got, uh, what we are looking forward to for next week, and a cool down. Those are the main things you have to hit when you do your test for the workshop. After all that is done, I will get a link either to tomorrow, today, or the next couple of days about the online certification part where I have to pass 90, get to your pro if you have a certain amount of pickleball experience and playing, uh, intermediate or a coach, and then just associates. Those are the three levels of coaching levels you can get. Once you get one of them, you can retest in a year if Sunny thinks or the pro thinks you could be on that level. But besides that, it was a great experience. I learned a ton about different games, different strategies, different kind of setups, how to properly teach a class. I would highly recommend it for anyone that is looking to become a pickleball coach or instructor. The class itself is very informative. The background information on the courses that come with it provide a lot of detail and information about how to actually make money. And I will let you know how the test goes. What's going on? Today is the final last step and process to become an official pickleball certified teacher. So far, we have signed up online, we have got our membership, we have paid our dues, we went to the workshop, we studied the material, and now we have to take the final written exam. A 70 will get you a associate coach, associate. The 80% will get you a coach level, and if you want to become a pro level coach, you have to get a 90 or above and also participate in tournaments and also win some gold medals as well, I believe, up for determination on their end. But one thing from the workshop that I did mention from the first recap is that if you are really good, but you act like a or you will not get certified. They will fail people and they will not let people pass if they are not teachable people and people who could teach other people. So keep that in mind if you're a very high skill level player, don't mess around, take it very seriously and just be friendly. Go, I passed with a 93%. Granted, it was a open book, so if you did not pass, try harder next time. But now I'm all certified, I'm all legal, I'm all cleared to coach. Now you can find out how these skills I learned as a coach are going to transfer over to my own personal games in my 3.5 tournaments I have here, 3.0 and 4.0s coming up.